another short video, this one another poem from of Snails and Skylarks called W.H. Alden. I came to you tardy and late as I usually do, the better things in my life, this hidden singing land I never knew, of eloquent weathers and the many-tongued sea, changing and ever changeless, drawing the moody skies into its mirror, and a true girl to love and steer my star by, at the comic end of it all, making me contemplate eternity with rather less rash enthusiasm than in my unpleasant spent years of dreaming. Others, kind in their way, insisted I read you. As I climbed the slippery ladder out of my cosy accepted mire, and like being pressed with strong medicine I held back, recalcitrant as a surly upstart pup, growling in its soiled lair, snapping at the hands that would feed it. You were dead before I stumbled upon the life that was in your poetry, upending your generation and doing needful miracles. On the ones that came limping or thundering after, dead but you would not lie safely down and only in the final weeks did I see your face televised out of human context, alien to the merciless medium, a crazy continent creviced with living, a rubbery sphere indented with tingled latitudes of honest pain, and the healing laughter that lies behind unambiguous suffering, speaking your verse in a tired, unlit voice, as if you wanted to close the door and be gone, to where you might at last pin down peace, drink unending wine and converse with friends, till all the sacred cows came home, the ones that you had not so gaily slaughtered on that maze journey into truth. I yet know only half of your mind, half of the world you made uniquely your own, and the other half beckons like an unexplored country, wherein I shall falter often early and late, be confused and befuddled by so many trails, lured by signs that lead apparently into nowhere, save that the nowhere you inhabited teemed with such life, as to leave me panting and many times lost in my belated crusade to find you. So, like I said, another short poem, but working through these books I've started, hoping to finish them sooner rather than later.